In this demonstration, we're going to look at expressions in RiotJS. We're going to use the people list tag from our previous example, and we're just going to add a couple of nice modifications to it. Expressions in RiotJS are 100% JavaScript, so they're really easy to write. Anything within a curly brace is considered an expression. Now, let's say I wanted to convert the name of my person to all uppercase. or if I wanted to multiply their age by two. Because we're working with normal JavaScript expressions, we can use a function for more complex needs. What I'd like to do next is take the age of a person, and if they're older than a certain age, I'd like to add a class, and if they're younger than a certain age, I'd like to add a class. Riot.js offers an intuitive way to add classes to our elements based upon expressions. The first thing I'd like to do is add the red class to anybody that's over the age of 60. I'm gonna call this function old farts and pass in the person's age as a parameter. Now to write the old farts function to make this thing work. As you can see, Judas61 is red. The way Riot.js handles CSS classes is that it takes an object where the property is the class name and the value is an expression. If the expression results in true or anything not faulty, then the class will be included in the HTML element. Now to add another class and expression to make anybody that's 20 and under blue. We'll call this function whippersnappers. And to add our CSS property and expression. So that looks like it works. Let's go ahead and test adding another person. And that's it. This concludes our demonstration on expressions and classes in Riot.js. Thanks for watching.